professionally, the course has uh, improved my skill set because it's kind of challenged me to go out there into the world and talk to people and get stories and also visualise these stories, make these stories for an audience. Leeds back, it's been a really great experience for me. Moving away from home was something that I was really nervous about, but the university in your first year really helps you to focus on meeting new people. They offer lots of different activities, and especially if you're in one of the student halls that are connected with the university, they have things like welcome barbecues, just to help you get to know the people you're going to be living around. For me personally, one of the best facilities was the fact that for the journalism course, we actually had our own media room, and that had lots of different computers in, and they had like a variety of programs that we had to work with so there's like things like InDesign and Photoshop which you will end up using at some point as well as video editing software and radio editing software so you can go in there maybe when if the library's too full you can go in there and have a quiet space where everyone around you is working on the same thing as well. To any potential student on the journalism course I would say as soon as possible build a relationship with your tutors as these tutors are some of the best tutors I've ever had and if you are on the same wavelength as them, they will help you throughout the course. The journalism course at Leeds Beckett requires that you take a three-week placement somewhere. Now that can be three weeks at one place, or you can mix it up and go to a variety of places. And I do think that going to a variety of places is better because you're going to change the platform that you're working on. I went to, firstly, in my first year, I went to a regional newspaper called the Sunderland Echo, where I worked in a newsroom. And there I worked in the offices, I went out on photo shoots, I went on interviews, I did some transcription work, and I actually got the opportunity to have a few of my stories published with a byline. And then in my between my second and third year, I went to Accent Magazines Group, which produces a number of magazines in the Northeast. I worked on a business one for them, and then a fashion and lifestyle one. And again, I went out and did interviews, I went along with a photographer, I did some typing up for them, and again I got to get my work published. So it's a great opportunity to go out to build your portfolio for some prestigious names. And on top of that, it's really great because you get to work with people who you might not normally work with. I worked with people of all different ages, backgrounds, people who'd been in the industry for years and some who were new. So it's really good in preparing you for the future. My major project was a 15 minute documentary uh, the title was Do Words Hurt? It was surrounding how the media portray Muslims um, across print and across broadcast. I interviewed Mehdi Hassan, Alex Crawford and Owen Jones, as well as various Muslims w within the community. The course has helped to prepare me for the future because when I started and came to university, I only ever thought about going into print media. I'd never thought about working in radio or broadcast but the course offers a variety of different skills and so I learned how to work with cameras, how to work in a radio studio, which now I believe is giving me more like career options.